Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Dragon Quest Builders! In the last episode, we were tasked with making up some fire and ice weapons, which I will do now. I also harvest my trees in between episodes. I'm going to build... 20 cis shots and 20 crack shots. Which will probably be more than I'll ever need. Uh-huh. I guess this helps us deal with the fire and ice flames. Well, yeah. Also, I should probably make wood. Where'd my wood go? Let's see, where's wood? Wood. All of the wood. 32 pieces of wood. You should show them your planting and what you did while we were gone. I already did, I thought. Didn't also, I want a king size bed. You... Okay. Oh, well, I just did that. There we go. Put the other bed in the other uh, house. Also, I can't fit the portrait in here anymore, so let's go ahead and Let move them that. see this when they wake up. Over here. There we go. Butch bedroom. <laughs> Two beds and a portrait of a lady. Increases maximum residence HP by 20%. Well, hey. Put that bed in there. Oh, yeah, I do have another bed. Sweet. Yay, look at that dress she's wearing. It's supposed to make her cute. What are you talking about? It is nice. Lucille, I mean. It is nice. Eh, I don't like it. Eh. Alright, Harmonia. Have you built any of them ice pistol thingies you dreamt up yet? We can use them to take down those dancing flames, which bring us another step closer to beating the magmalis. Let me tell you something, Harmonia. According to Galileo's records, when you freeze a dance in flame, it leaves behind a flame orb. And those are exactly what we need to build an even more powerful weapon. That's what you gotta do, Harmonia. Build a load of them crack shots and fire them at the dance of flames. You know where to find them, right? They hang out around the front of that castle the monsters locked me up in. Go over there and kick up a ruckus and bring me back five flame orbs, why don't you? Alright, sounds like we gotta go back to the blue teleportal. To the blue... And you know, we didn't actually spend a lot of time over there. Before we do, though, I have a need for some food. I'm gonna go cut some cactus down, make up some cactus steaks. To traveling! So I'm actually gonna cut that out, because it's just gonna be me wandering around the desert for several minutes. And I'll meet you on the other side of the blue teleportal. I'll be right back. And back! I'm in the middle of the desert near a gigantic cactus, getting attacked by iron scorpions. I, fo I found this giant cactus and this sign that says 7 North 33 East. And I'm guessing it means 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 this way. I wish there was a guard button. Yep, Am I still on 7? Blocks east. You might want to count blocks, Robert. Maybe best to pull out a... Uh... Yeah. Let's One. See. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6... Seven, so that would put me there. Thirty-three that way. One. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventy, eight, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three. 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, about right here. Yeah. Dig. Um... I don't know. Oh! Oh, hey, what do you know? I found it. Uh, can I have what's in it? It's upstairs. Oh, it's a ring! Ooh! Let's get the heck back out of here. Go don't away, you... Iron Scorpion asshole! Gold ring. It's gold. Oh, I have rings already. I have a ring of awakening. And a ring of strength. What's the. Increases max HP by 10. I think that's better than the ring of awakening right now, wouldn't you say? Yes. I'm gl aren't you glad you had me do this now? Oh, hey! This is even better! Oh. Steel sabatons. Reduces falling damage, but I don't need falling damage that much. Especially when we once had the free fall with shoes. 
I need to put this hole back. We'll cut back out again then until we're back at, on the other side of the portal? Yep. When I get back to the portal, that's when I'll cut back. I'll All see right. you guys then. And after a bunch of meandering and screwing around, we're back in the place of lava and death. Alright. Back to the castle we go. Yep. Time to go kill some stuff. I see one of them already. So do I. And it's got a golem. I'm gonna ignore it. What's up, Brownie? You dead. Hammerhead. It doesn't matter. Yeah, it's it does. dead. Because hammerheads actually speak. I haven't heard a brownie speak yet. Yeah, it does. We've run into speaking brownies. Oh. Guess I forgot. The one that taught us the gravestone recipe. Right. It's just been a while. I mean, seriously, this Let's Play is longer than most anything else I've done. Not Except really. for Fire Emblem. Considering I'm still not done. As it has been going on longer. Let's get some crack shots out and get ready to shoot stuff. I can't wait to see how is this Is crack works. the name of the fire, uh, the ice spell? Yes. That's a pr and it says it's the name of the fire spell. Which makes sense. Yeah. So like I said, it's the closest thing you can get to magic in this game. But with no casting time. Well, it's not really casting time in the game, in the regular games, either. Okay, so where's the dancing flames that are supposed to be here? Can I hit it from here? Nope, I suck. You still suck. Luckily, it only takes one. If you hit. Stop stomping after me. Leave me alone. What Stupid. a bunch of BS. Can I kill this thing? Yes, I can, but it would take for freaking ever. Two flame orbs collected. Ah, ah, ah. Well, where's the rest of them, game? I actually took zero damage from that magma dude hitting me. Mm -hmm. Or, well, that... The uh, hand. Hand, yeah. The hand! The hand! The hand. Even I don't know where the things go that I destroy with the hand. Hey, Dancing Flame! Get up on land where I can kill you. I think that's fake. Oops. That's partly why you made another set. One more. There's four. I'm gonna collect one. a lot more than four, though. You need five? You just gonna go around and kill some more? Yeah. I'm also gonna take this time to explore. I mean, we've barely been here. Yeah. Ooh, a decimal herb plant. Just kind of lounging about in this area of death. So, since there's the plenty, last... There's probably plenty of different secrets and stuff strewn about here. I forgot to mention this during the last two episodes. I finally started Fire Emblem Echoes. Also, I want to show you something. Lava is not instant death, but it hurts like a son of a bitch. I noticed it didn't barely do any damage to the knight, who should have honestly been baked alive. Ow. In his armor. You know what? I have 99 blocks of earth. I'm going over there. <laughs> But well, seriously, Echoes is so much fun. And it's nice to see Fire Emblem 2 finally get to America. Even if it's almost two decades late. Well, there's a ton of Fire Emblems that never made it to America. But they're working on it, which means we'll get which means we'll get New Mystery of the Emblem in a couple of years. Which is three. And then we'll get Genealogy, which I've been looking forward to. And Thracia. And then we'll finally get Roy's game. Maybe. They'll give it to us eventually. They finally realized we liked the series. Also, there's a pillar here that almost always has a useful item on it. So I'm going to go up here and find out what it is. Alright. Well, 
like how you can do that. It is useful. Can I build anything? A torch and a cypress stick. It's all useless. Useless! Useless bag. But creepy stuff happens in nowhere. And it's up to courage to save his new home. Stupid dog you made me look bad. Ooga, 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 ooga. Ooga. Ah! Our childhood. Yeah. Ooh, Ooh useful. always helpful. Especially when you get so many of them at once. You stupid bird. Let's see, can I find a safe place to drop down? Well, I only took eight damage. I think that's a success. I think you healed one or two of it before you landed. Be gone, Chimeras! What? Man, this lava looks pretty uh, awesome at night. That was a lava block. I thought the, I wasn't sure what I was seeing out there in the middle of the lava. Ah, I couldn't make the jump. Never mind that in real life that would have been fatal. As Zelda likes to remind us every time Link's around a lava stage. Some coal. Because apparently I'm out of coal. I didn't even realize that happened. <laughs> there are some more secrets and interesting things around here, but mm -hmm. finding them is going to be annoying. Slightly. Zero damage. Yeah, these guys can't hurt me because of that blocks 50% of damage thing from right. direct attacks. That is so nice. Distance attacks still hurt, though. Yeah. Did I go in here? I'm gonna find out. Clodstone. Crumbling Clodstone, specifically. Yeah. The regular stuff's not all that bad. And I just picked up a bunch of the stuff I didn't want. At least it goes into uh, the thing and can take up our main space. Yep. It's not like you were stuck in a hole like you were uh, earlier this episode. Indeed. Which I may or may not have it split for. Ow! Oh! Should have brought people to, with me. Time to slay now. They to die. Dang it, there's way too many of them. Stupid ghosts. Luckily, I'm taking so very little damage, it's not even funny. Down One down. Go. He dropped me another guard. Ow. At least you're taking little damage, yeah. Ow! He remembers! Three Dang. down! These guys were nothing. Yay! Give me what was in here. Ooh! Oh, that's useful. That was a helpful reward. And you did it all on your own. Yep, with no help from people that I should have brought with me. <laughs> Sconce. More light in the darkness for when all the lights go out. What was I doing? I don't remember. Uh, you were hunting down uh, the, the, the dancing flames. Think I might come up here. Collect some wheat. Learn and to conjure bread. What the hell is that? What? Conjure bread? I don't know. Hardy cream cake. Holy crap! Pile of pancakes! These are all really good f hunger foods. I need to get some wheat. More it's too bad farming isn't a thing in this chapter. Yeah, I hope Probably we Probably because we're in the middle of a desert. I hope we get it next chapter, but I have a bad feeling about the next chapter. Yeah, I don't think we get any, any useful provisions in the next chapter. I already know a little bit about it because Robert told me. I'm not looking forward to it. When he was trying to sell me on the game, he told me about how bad it was. It's a tough final chapter starting out, but in the mid-game, it gets a lot easier. 
because you've gotten stuff because you've gotten stuff taken care of to make it easier to live. Yeah. I'm just enjoying the music. Agreed. I don't even know how much wheat we've gotten. I don't either, but we can't... Well, we can look, but the monsters are everywhere. Hmm. Well, I, wonder how, I wonder how Ammonia checks the Colossal Coffer from right here. Does she have a mini one in her pocket? Who knows? That would actually be funny, though, wouldn't it? It's just a mini Colossal Wow, listen coffer. to that, that air. Mm -hmm. You can hear the wind whipping around. That's actually pretty cool. Well, you are on a death cliff. There's no way you're getting back up if you fall down. Oh, uh, well, that's definitely fake. Yeah, I'd say so, too. I don't see anything useful up here. Except death. And chimeras. I need some more wings, anyway. Plus, having wings means I can make it back here. Hey, monster egg. Nice. Well, not back here. Back from here. Yeah. There are a ton of secrets in this game. Trying to find them all is difficult. But I've already found several. I'm going to head back the way I came. Because I know there's some secrets down in that hot area. More monster egg. Also helpful. You're a lousy shot and you should feel bad. How bad should you feel, Robert? Very bad. That's bad. Seriously, these white blocks think they're clever. They're not. Though More they, Chimera Wings! So they might be a unique enemy in this game, but I kind of doubt it. They're probably a different game, I just didn't I just don't know. Die! Die, giant chimera! Well, that was a missed jump. Even though Good I pressed the jump, jump button. Taking for damage, you idiot. That's enough out of you, pal. <laughs> More cacti. Hot and spring? hot spring. Unfortunately, um, it's not a hot spring that restores your health, which is kind of sad. It should be. Really, game? I think you need some of that blue goo, man. Maybe. Well, there used to be tracks here. This is a puzzle. When the track is joined for a cart to ride, once more the chest will open wide. Now, I don't know what we need in order to fix the track here. Uh, it looks like we need track for one. Well, yeah. Alright, we need at least one piece of straight track. One, one piece of angled track. Two no. pieces of straight track. One corner track. Yeah, I'm just gonna have to build a little bit of everything and then come back. Mm -hmm. uh, it's so peaceful out here. Yep, sure is. Yeah. Seriously, I see you remember us needing blue goo for something. Mm -hmm. Eat this. Um, are you okay, sir? Um, yeah, I think you look tasty. I can make up her up. Let's see, hot spring, hole in the wall, peeping Tom. What manner of knave art thou to enter a lady's bath uninvited? I had a feeling I was being watched, and now it would seem the culprit hath revealed herself. Anyway, foul rogue, be gone! Be gone! What do you say? Uh huh. Gary, where's that lady go? Me so hungry. I question why she is taking a bath all the way out here. What? Twas not thee who didst lay an ambush against me, but a foul and loathsome troll? Tis curious that the fiend did not attack. Mayhaps he was in fact a fine and gentlemanly troll, dedicated to protecting gentlewomen from harm. Though that what though what harm could come to a ghost like me, I know not. Ha <laughs> ha! 
I owe thee my thanks, stranger. As reward for thy service, allow me to regale unto thee the long and storied history of the public baths of Elgard. Oh, we're gonna, we're gonna get to upgrade it again? Well, is it not a fascinating subject? Doth thy mind not brim with possibilities as to how thine own baths might be improved? Fierce, Fierce fountain. fountain. So she's a ghost? Behold the coal public baths. Enter a wanderer and cleanse thyself. Oft would my dear departed grandmother be thou such a greeting at the travelers who entered our town. It will soon be time for me to depart this world, and join my grandmother in the great beyond. But until that time cometh, I shall while away my hours in these baths, and watch my, gross, my, my ghostly fingers grow as wrinkly as hers. Make me wonder how she died, then. Who knows? Who knows She's... anything? And how long ago she died? She must have died a long time ago to already be a Oh, kid. hey, look! Look what it is! What? Oh! I can't even injure it. It's got too much health. What was that? It cast cast a fire spell on me instead of running away. No, it didn't. The thing did. No, it cast a fire spell. Oh. I thought that was the, uh... It sizzed. Did it sizz? Hmm. No point, really. I think we're done here. I'm gonna head back. I have All what right. I came for. Oh, actually, no, I haven't gotten what I came for. I wanted more of those flaming orbs. You completely forgot, even though I reminded you. All right. Time to go back and collect some more. Even we... though that's going to take a while for me to get to them. It's so much fun watching you cross this place again. Yeah, it's annoying, but I won't be taking the same route back. I'm still searching for secrets and stuff. Ooh, Seacrest. Seacrests? What about Ryan? Yeah, another night time is here. Put block in wall. Climb. This is how you do it. See, I'm almost back as it is. And more wheat! Good. Could always use more gunge bread. Oh, yeah. And everything else on that list. You imagine fighting a boss and just nomming down a pile of pancakes? Except they don't restore health. Oh, right. The only one that restored health was actually the Gunger bread. Also, there's a whole mine section over there that I've never explored. Ever? Well, I've been over there, but that was where I suffered my first death in my original playthrough. I got on some clod stone, and it crumbled, and it landed me in lava, and I couldn't get out. Oh, boy. No wonder you hate Cloudstone. Yes, Cloudstone is the bane of my existence. Man, you think you would have gotten to where the fires were yet by now. Actually, I was going the wrong way, methinks. Not exactly the wrong way, but, you know, I think Not I was the... heading back Every... to the entrance. Oh. Good job. There's the castle gate. Let me get my crack shots back. And there is an orb. That's all he is, huh? Just an orb? Words on the signpost written. Monster's mine. No humans allowed. Hands off our iron. Monster's castle. No humans allowed. Hands off our prisoners. <laughs> Gee, thanks for telling me exactly where everything is. Finally, I sniped something with a bullet. <laughs> that was good, Robert. Crack shot. Are you, though? Maybe not. You know what? You guys are on my nerves. My very last one. See how you like it. How'd you like getting hit with a taste of your own medicine? I can throw fireballs too. And I literally throw them with no cast time. So it does take some aiming. Yeah, I have to be a good aim. It makes me wish there was a lock on in this game. So in other words, I would fail miserably. Can I have some flame? I mean, some dancing flame? Wait a minute. Oh? I never opened this. Oh, cool. Get this little herb. I could make a treasure room now. <laughs> I never opened this either. It's just a corpse. Dang it, why couldn't I re rescue wood. him? Where'd my wood go? I'm running out of time. Crack shot. 
I think that's eight now. How many do you need? Uh, I want a bunch. Just a bunch. No real number, just a bunch. I think nine. ten ought to do it. Oh, eight. of course it's nine. I was... I could have looked. He's trying to punch me. I take offense to this. So do I. You're not allowed to punch my friend. I only have two like him. Crack shot. It hit the rock. Wow, Robert. Well, I have ten. Heading Don't back. you remember what we learned in Pokemon? Rock is not weak to ice. Which is odd, because you'd think the permafrost would break it up. But ground is. Alright, in the next episode, I will turn in this quest to get one step closer to giving the Magmalis a cold shoulder. See you in the next episode!